share with you why Jesus, why Jesus is the only perfect sacrifice for our sin, why Jesus is the only way through which we can come to the Father, why is Jesus the only exclusive possibility that we have for our escaping the judgment of God. Number one, Jesus is sinless. First Peter chapter 2 and verse 22 says, Jesus committed no sin and no deceit was found in his mouth. First Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 22 says, Christ who knew no sin became sin so that we can become the righteousness of Jesus. Hebrew chapter 4 and verse 15 says, we have an high priest who is able to bear with our own infirmity, who was tempted in every way like us, and yet without sin. Okay, so he knew no sin, he did no sin, he committed no sin. It's even Quran says, Jesus is the only righteous person in flesh. Number two is that the resurrection of Jesus, the death and the resurrection of making making the absolute, making the sufficient sacrifice for our sin. The book of First Corinthians chapter 15 and verse 14 says, if Christ has not been raised from the dead, our preaching is useless, so is your faith. First Corinthians 15 and verse 17, if Christ has not been raised from the dead, your faith is futile and you are still in your sin. Okay, Romans chapter 4 and verse 25, Christ died for our sin and he was raised for our justification. So, Jesus becomes the only option to be considered for the salvation of our soul because Jesus was the only one who died and was raised for our sin. Number three is that Romans chapter 8 and verse 3, the Bible says, What law was, was not powerful to do? What law was weak to do in the flesh? God sent his only son to come and become identified with our sin. And in this and in this way, he destroyed the power of sin over our life. Okay? So, Jesus identified with our sin and broke the power of sin. And meet God's condition for the penalty of our sin. So, it becomes the only option to be considered. Works does not save the man. Religion does not save the man. Only Jesus, Jesus becomes the only option that God has given to us that is sufficient for our sin. Regardless from, regardless of the tribe, the sex, and the status we are coming from. That's why John 3 16 says, For God so loved God that he gave something because of whosoever. Jesus didn't come to die for Muslim. Jesus came to die for all of us. And no, nobody is born a Muslim. All of us are born sinner. Nobody is born a Christian. All of us are born sinner. The only solution to the problem of sin is to accept the offer of of God in Jesus to be cleansed for our sin. Thank you. God bless you.